Well, do you want to see God's hand move in your community? If so, what can you do? Four area churches believe that prayer, praise, and reading scripture are keys to bringing hope and revival to our region. Jennifer has details on the most recent Ignite service, which took place at Restoration Temple Church right here in Lima. It was a night of declaration, a night for a group of like-minded individuals from different locations to come together in unity and say, we believe. A night to rejoice, a night to call to action. The service was called Ignite, the third in a series of unified voices joining together to corporately praise and pray and believe God has a purpose for this region. So, Father, we come before you in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father, for... I'm going to thank you, Father, that your hand is upon this city. Yes. Yes. I'm going to thank you for every church yes. Yes. that's in this city and that surrounds this city. Nothing flashy, no special skits or sermons during this time, but two hours of dedicated prayer and worship and a belief that God has a purpose. Broken lives can be restored and a community can come together to accomplish great things for Christ. And Lord, we just ask that, Father God, that you would just let there be such a unity in the body and such a oneness of heart and mind and soul that, Lord, the enemy could not come in and divide. This event was organized by Pastor Brandon Green of Calvary Chapel of Praise. It was held at Restoration Temple and included members from Agape Fellowship and Firm Foundation, as well as individuals from other churches in the community. Lord, we know that by the precious blood of the Lamb, we have the privilege of being children of God. We come into the presence of God with thanksgiving, with boldness and access, with confidence by the faith of the Lord Jesus Christ. And what was the purpose? Well, to do what the name implies. Ignite, to arouse, to bring about or provoke suddenly a move of God in this region. The next Ignite prayer and worship service will take place at Firm Foundation Christian Center, but a date has not been set. We'll definitely let you know when it is scheduled.